While the crystal footballs and Heisman trophies certainly catch your eye in the Moore Athletic Center, there's something else just as valuable around the corner that is the goal of every Florida State football player, to make it here and to be one of those top ten. Yeah, that's probably one of the most, you know, prized things I could have, you know, as a as a player, you know, as a student here at Florida State, being recognized for having good grades. Uh, anytime my parents, you know, my grandmothers and, you know, my sister, they come in town, they, they're able to see my picture up on that wall. It means a lot to them, not just me. It's something we strive for, and, and, and I'm definitely proud. Like, something my mom can, and dad and sister and my whole and the extended relatives, if they come to a game, kind of go up there and look at it and say, you know, like, he's representing, he's representing the family. And it's that goal that has defined Florida State football. Under head coach Jimbo Fisher, academics are the number one priority, and it shows. This season, the Seminoles have 11 current players who have received their undergraduate degrees, including E.J. Manuel, Dustin Hopkins, Everett Dawkins, and Amp McLeod. It's all about grades, you know what I mean? Football comes second, you know what I mean? I, like, the reason they recruit us for academics and football without academics you're not able to get on the field and play on Saturdays. It feels good to be out on the field with a lot of guys you know that's graduated already you know that shows a lot of leadership you know a lot of wisdom on the team a lot of people that have been around for a long time and know the progress that we've made. And we've got a lot of guys on the team um, that have done that and hope, hopefully those young guys look at that and see that um, it's something they can kind of uh, model themselves after because like, so many guys have done it in different programs and different positions. And that's something Coach Fisher could not be more proud of, to see the veterans lead by example, both in the classroom and on the field. Approximately another eight to ten that will graduate a half a semester early. And our graduation rate in the last two years, these last two classes, has been 74 to 82 percent, which is tremendous. It's up there very high. Uh, that's what I want because it's going to affect the quality of their life more than anything else. Ball's going to end at some time, and they got to have something to fall back on and who they're going to be. Man, I feel like I don't took a great step in life, you know what I mean, being able to graduate from Florida State, something I never dreamed or ever thought about doing, graduating from college. You know, when we have 10, 12 guys that already have their degrees and things like that, it says a lot about you know, not just you know our, us as athletes, but us as also you know good students. And it's good to see that you know, academics are being uh, held up on this pedestal because they should be, because they're, they're important. And that's the foundation that has been set and will last for generations to come, winning on the field and in the classroom. I'm Scott Kodak reporting for Seminoles.com.